Hello, Pocono Mountains and Lake Long Paul Pack region. Bridget Gelderman, Associate Broker with Davis R. Chant, and I'm here to bring you the February statistics from the Pike Wayne MLS. Stay tuned, we'll be right back. Thank you and welcome back. I wanted to bring you the statistics for February 2019. Uh, we are into March now, but I want to make sure we re re recap and look at how we did in February. Homes going under contract in February, February were down 2% from last February. However, our inventory is very, very low, so it's hard. Um, there's not as many homes to choose from, so going under contract on homes right now is not as easy as it once was a few years ago when we had more listings. The market closed on 115 homes this February compared to 141 homes last February, and we're down about 10% year to date on sold listings. Again, that's probably attributed a lot to our um, inventory. Our active listings are down almost 10% year to date. So despite having less inventory, we're only down 2% in homes going under or in homes going under contract. So that's actually really good news um, since our inventory is pretty low. Our average days on market is down 5% year to date. So it's about 131 days, which is roughly four months. And our absorption rate continues to decline. I looked this up. We're down 10% year to date. We're now at 6.46 months to sell off all of our inventory. December 2014, which was about um, you know four years ago, we were down, we were at 15.79. So that was more than double to sell off all the inventory in our MLS. So when we say that our inventory is low, we really do mean it, and it just goes to show that four years ago this market was in a whole different place. Our price range that saw the biggest increase going under contract was 500,000 plus. It was up 100%, and it's up that price point is up 75% year to date, which that's actually a really good indicator for the market. It means those higher end houses are moving, and that always is good news for the entire market overall. 250 to 299 was up 63%, and 90 to 99 was up 66%. Our biggest decrease going under contract, and I picked homes above 100,000. Um, our biggest decrease was 180 to 200,000. That was that one's down about 40% year to date. The highest end home that sold in our market last month was in Homesdale for 997,000, and it's a 103 acre um, a house um, set on 103 acres in Homesdale. Our least expensive single family house that sold in Pike and Wayne County was $24,000 over in Walpole Pack Lake Estates, and it was a three bedroom, one bath home. So that's just a little bit of information on the market. If you have any questions, you would like to review this information as it pertains to you purchasing or selling your home, please feel free to reach out to me. Thank you so much for liking my page on Facebook and subscribing to my channel on YouTube. Have a great day, bye.